I'm here with the student from Metropolitan FC, Ernie Semsek. Ernie, very important game for the club tonight because, you know, if you would have lost today, you would have been amongst the bunch behind uh, Pascaval. So your second spot and chasing uh, that great team, Pascaval. Do you think you can catch him? Um, I think I think we can. I mean, we have to. We have to think we can. Everyone needs to. Pascaval, very good team, very organised. They seem to step up week in, week out. But That's why your glory days came at Pascaval. Uh, yeah, I mean, they, they, every week they, you know, you think, oh, they've plateaued, then they can't go any higher. But every week they step up. But anyway, they're setting the benchmark. We'll try and follow. Today game, tough game against Humlock. It always is. First time round, they absolutely slapped you, eight three. What was the game plan going into tonight differently compared to the first time he's played in round one? We, we only had one on the bench tonight, so... That helps, doesn't it? He seemed to do well with one on the yeah, bench. Yeah, I think what happens is mentally we all have to put in when we're on the park because we've got to help one another more than every other. It shouldn't be the case, but it seems to be that way, so... There was a crucial yeah. part in the game at 4-3 when Alexander Stavanovic was losing his cool and losing his marbles and the great manager Alia Radzevich pulled him off and then he's came away to win 6-3. How important that was that move in the game by Alia? Do you think you probably would have lost the game if Atsa stayed on the field? Well, with Atsa, I mean, fantastic player. He can lose his call. We all know that. You know, I, I, I don't know that Atsa would have full-on lost his call and, you know, got sent off. But, yeah, good call by the uh, coach. You know, we ended up winning 6-3. But I think with us, we know as long as we can defend well, we're always going to score. So that's what we're concentrating on.